And this is the astrological forecast for the sign of Virgo for January 2017, brought to you by the wonderful people at AskTheAnswer.com, the UK's leading website for tarot readers, psychics and mediums. Virgo, um, it's a bit of a weird month. Firstly, you've got a Mercury retrograde going on in the first 10 days of the month, which means that communications generally are pretty screwed up and you're not going to be able to make sense of what's going on in the world around you, let alone in your personal life. Secondly, you've got both Venus and Mars, the two planets that rule relationships, in your opposite sign of Pisces. And this is going to bring a lot of issues around one-to-one -one relationship patterns sharply into focus. You're not going to be able to make clear sense of everything, whether at uh, the one-to-one -one level, whether that's personal and intimate, friend, social, professional or family. It doesn't matter. As long as it's one-to-one -one situations, you'll find that whilst there will be developments and events, that final outcomes and final choices won't become apparent until you're into the end of the month. The more you get towards the end of the month, the more you're going to find that communication really begins to clear up and that you're going to find that things do develop in ways that bring clarity, uh, understanding and comprehension with a great deal more ease. But I still don't think it's a good time for you to be making big decisions based on your interaction with other people at the one-to-one -one level. And I'm afraid that's going to stay like that until the end of January. From February onwards, it's a different story. The pressure is off and you will be in a much better position to make informed and objective choices. But I think it's safe to say that as far as January 2017 goes, Virgo, have a quiet and relatively patient month.